Hey guys, what is up? Hope you're having a fantastic day so far, and I am here with a Steven Universe discussion video. So really, this video isn't anything like a theory, it's just some ideas that I have about the upcoming episode, Line 4 Alternate Ending. So if you haven't heard, there's going to be an episode called Line 4 Alternate Ending, but unfortunately, it is not going to be airing March 23rd like it was first speculated to be. The source of this is usually pretty good at getting the actual episode titles, but unfortunately, their air dates are usually way off. So, no line for March 23rd, uh, but we should be getting this episode relatively soon. We're coming towards the end here of Season 4, so, I mean, it's, it's going to be coming up sooner or later. And it's possible that this actually might be part of a Steven Bomb to close out Season 4 uh, for the season finale, which I think would be really awesome. And I mean, the whole entire zoo arc and then you know navy just came and took the ruby ship so i mean homeworld could be coming a lot sooner than we think and i think that'd be a great way to close out season four but uh yeah i'm getting a little bit ahead of myself here but let's look at line four alternate ending so the thing with the line episodes is that all of them have something to do with films or movies except the first one steven's line where steven just meets line for the first time but Lion 2, the movie, dealt with Steven and Connie and Lion trying to go see the movie Dogcopter, and then this is where Steven first gets Rose's sword. And then Lion 3, straight to video, is when Steven gets to go inside Lion's mane for the first time, and then he finds the VHS tape that is a message from Rose to Steven. So now we have Lion 4 alternate ending, and, you know, I mean, the title of this episode is very mysterious because how how could there be an alternate ending it's just it it sparks a lot of questions because the line episodes have something to do with rose basically every single time and if we look at everything that was in this tree the first time that we saw inside lion's mane we have the bubble bismuth the flag rose's sword the Mr. Universe t-shirt, the VHS tape, and then this chest. So Bismuth is now bubbled and is in the burning room where they keep all the other bubble gems. The flag we've seen in Rose's scabbard, and this is most likely just Rose's flag that she had during the rebellion. We know about Rose's sword, we've seen the VHS tape, we know how Rose got the Mr. Universe shirt. So the only real big question that we have right now is what is this chest and what is inside this chest? And also, how is this chest related to the title of the episode, Alternate Ending? Now for me, when I hear alternate ending, I'm trying to think in terms of the show and what has alternate endings in the show, and this made me think of Garnet's Future Vision. Future Vision is basically a plethora of different alternate endings to a situation. If you look at an episode like Winter Forecast, when Garnet gives Steven future vision for that episode, he basically sees a bunch of alternate endings to the situation of him and his dad trying to get Connie home in time before this blizzard hits. So I'm not sure how this would be set up in the show exactly. This chest looks like it needs a key, and I'm not sure if Steven has the key. I mean, it could be Steven trying to find the key to open this chest, and so maybe he asks for Garnet to uh, give him her future vision, so that way he could find the key, or maybe just kind of see possibilities of what could be inside the chest. Uh, and then, you know, if he opens it, it's, it's not actually what he thought was going to be in the chest is something entirely different. I know there's been a lot of speculation about what is inside this chest. Uh, a lot of people think that it might be pink diamond shards. I don't think that Rose would leave Steven pink diamond shards, because if you look at everything else, everything else pretty much makes sense in terms of why Rose would leave it uh, inside Lion for Steven, except Bismuth, but Bismuth really wasn't meant for Steven to find. Uh, Rose put Bismuth inside Lion so that way she could hide Bismuth from Garnet and Pearl without them finding out about the uh, fight that Rose and Bismuth had. So that's the only reason why Bismuth is included with this other stuff and now Bismuth is out of the tree in Lion's Mane. She's uh, bubbled up in the burning room with the other ones. So yeah, so I mean, this is the chest is the only real big mystery that we have left inside Lion's Mane. 
Uh, but I mean, Lion himself is an entirely different mystery along with Rose, so I mean, that will definitely be interesting to see what happens there. But yeah, I just kind of wanted to uh, spitball some ideas at you guys and see what you think, uh, what you think of Lion 4, what you think is inside this chest, the meaning behind the title alternate ending. Personally, I think that Garnet's future vision might come into play here, uh, but let me know what you think because I would love to hear it. But thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more Steven Universe related content and until next time guys, take care.